In this equation, we have C7H6O plus O2. This is a combustion reaction. We have carbon dioxide and water as our products here. So organic combustion. Let's balance the equation. We have seven carbon atoms, six hydrogen atoms, and then we have one oxygen atom plus the two here. Make sure you count those three oxygen atoms. Product side, one carbon, two hydrogens, and then two oxygens. Plus, don't forget the one in the oxygen. So three total oxygen atoms. At this point, let's just start by putting a seven in front of the CO2. One times seven, that'll give us seven carbon atoms. Those are balanced and we'll need to update our oxygens now. So we have seven times two, that's 14, plus the one in the oxygen, 15. Let's put a three in front of the H2O, two times three, that would give us six hydrogens. So we've balanced the hydrogens now we need to update the oxygens again. So at two times seven, that's our 14, plus one times three, gives us a total of 17 oxygen atoms. So now this is kind of awkward here. The way to think about this is we have an oxygen here, and then we have our two oxygens here. So one plus something would give us 17. One plus 16, that equals 17. So we put an eight here. One plus two times eight is 16, so that would give us 17. So we have our one oxygen plus eight times two, 16. That gives us 17. This equation is balanced. This is Dr. V with the balanced equation for C7H6O plus O2. Thanks for watching.